verify this following identity. We can break this down into si uh, using double angle formula. I don't I think I got it here. Okay, I guess I don't got it, <laughs> but that's okay. All right, so this is the same thing as two sine of x, cosine of x. <laughs> and on the bottom, there's a few ways we can go about doing this, but oh, let me think here. It's the same thing as cosine squared x minus sine squared x. <clears throat> so, um, trying to figure this out. I know what to do. So cosine's on the bottom, which means um, we can convert. Yeah, okay, I know what to do. All right, so we can convert this into um, minus one minus cosine squared x. So this becomes two sine of x cosine of x over one plus cosine squared x minus one plus cosine squared x. So the ones cancel off, we're left with two sine x cosine x all over two cosine squared x. Twos cancel out and this cosine on the bottom cancels this out and we're left with just cosine x and we're left with sine of x over cosine of x. And this is the same thing as just saying tangent of x. And that's it. Alrighty. I hope this problem helped you out. I appreciate you watching and you have yourself a great day.